Hello. Today I'm going to show you how to uh, download models from Sketchfab and then put them into Unity. Sketchfab is a place where you can get 3D models. So, yeah. First thing you want to do is just look up Sketchfab or whatever. You might have to make an account. I don't know. It's been so long. So, yeah. You might have to make an account. Whatever. So, you'll search 3D models where it says downloadable check that so you can like download them and then what and then this is just for any model that you can download so i'm just gonna look up a random thing monster i've used this model before see so this i'm just i looked up a random thing you can just get any model you want so I, let's say i like this model right i click this download button and then it has to be a dot fbx or this one dot fbx so if it's not dot fbx right here and it's like there like let's say it's uh it's maybe this one yeah let's say if it's dot day or unknown format or dot blend you can't do that it has to be dot fbx so you just click download then as you see up here it'll say this zip it'll say whatever you downloaded dot zip you want to click this show in folder button and then when it shows you in folder it'll be in your downloads you want to right click on it and then click extract all and then here right here you want to keep this checked and then click extract and then it'll bring you to this. Then you just click downloads. And then you'll see it. It's like highlighted right here. So you want to just take it. And then drag it into Unity. So I made a folder called monsters to put this into. So I'm going to put it in there. You can make a folder and put it in there. Or you could just drag it into your assets. Whatever works. So now as you can see. Right here, Monster Eye, and I click, so I double click on Monster Eye, double click on Source, and then drag it in, and then as you can see, it's quite small, so I'm going to scale it up, and holy crap, as you can see, here's the model, but it doesn't look good. Once you have your model in the scene, it may look a little weird, so you'd want to click on it again, but instead of clicking Source, click Textures. And then you probably won't be able to drag on the textures directly or directly in here. So I'd recommend opening it up. And as you can see, there's this thing called Mesh 2 and Poly Surface, which is all this. So I would just take one of the textures and then drag it onto Poly Surface. As you can see, now he has that texture. And then if I drag his other texture onto this one, as you can see, I just successfully downloaded a model and put it in from sketchfab and put it into unity so yeah by the way it will not have colliders so you can't collide with it but yeah that's it so, yeah <laughs> bye